Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. My name is Chelsea and this is Sunny. Yes, this is my sister Sunny who you may have seen a couple times on my channel. Mm -hmm. Today we're back with a brand new food video. So what are we doing today? We're comparing the pancakes of four different oh. fitness influencers <laughs> plus an original pancake recipe. So we'll be testing all of these fitness influencers pancakes on how good they taste and how close they are to the original. So Sunny was kind enough to make us all of these pancakes including the original like buttermilk yeah these are the perfect buttermilk pancakes from nyt cooking by allison roman yeah yeah yeah. so we we'll can be comparing link the recipes all down below so this is like the baseline of the quintessential pancake and we'll compare all of these yeah as you can see a lot of these look very different some of them are dark because the protein powder that the recipe included or i guess our no, protein powder our the protein powder we had yeah was actually green so they turned the pancakes dark yeah but. and some of them got a little bit burned so we'll have to take our own user error into account so without further ado let us get started into each pancake okay so we didn't mention this but we're going to put the same toppings of fruit and maple syrup on each pancake so there's no bias there Ooh, ooh. Uh, i don't even know where to start i think all the fruit is just gonna fall <laughs> yeah we just have to eat the fruit separately i guess so okay yeah. <laughs> this is definitely very good. The taste, of course, is like a 9, and the closeness to original is obviously 10. 10 being the most close. Because, because it, it is. is. Yeah. Oops, I don't think we should be eating that much. Yeah, we should not much. be eating that well, much. We say as we eat more. But like, these just have the classic taste of pancakes that are sort of, you know, eggy, yes. a little bit salty. Okay, stop, 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 stop eating. Up first with the influencer pancakes is Linda Sun. As many of you may know her, her pancakes have become very popular. It was the iconic recipe on her channel, mm -hmm. so of course we had to make it. So this pancake has banana, oats, baking powder, protein powder, almond milk, egg, PB2, which we changed to peanut butter, cinnamon, and chocolate chips in it. So quite a lot of ingredients, but hopefully they will come together. Whoa, it's very soft. Yeah. Okay. Uh oh, what if it's raw? It's not raw, it's not raw. Okay, so it has a lot of chocolatey taste, I think, because of the chocolate chips, but it's also kind of grainy, which I think is because of the protein powder. Yeah, I think my protein powder might be the problem. Yeah. It's kind of bitter. Yeah, it is a little bit bitter. Okay. It's okay. What would Texture you sounds great. Maybe like a four out of ten. I think for this scale, under five is something yeah. that I wouldn't eat again. Oh, I see. Okay. We actually made Linda Sun's recipe before when we mm -hmm. didn't have protein powder and it was better than oh, this. Oh yeah, that was fine. I don't know how much this is due to our own problem or the recipe's problem. I'll eat this again. No, just kidding. If I it didn't have protein powder, I wouldn't then eat we're this not again. Eating okay, never mind. My rating is a three. Bruh, okay. Yeah. As for how close it is to the actual pancake recipe, it's pretty far off. How close it is? I mean, like zero. I think it's okay close. Like, it has the pancake shape. <laughs> it has the shape? Maybe a little bit of fluffiness? Or yeah. maybe like a two? Yeah, I would say like two or three. Sorry. Oh yeah, by the way, disclaimer, we're not saying bad things about the individual influencers themselves, just testing their recipe. Okay, moving on. Okay, next up we have Natasha Oceans, and her ingredients include oats, egg whites, almond milk, sucrine and salt for taste which is just artificial sugar and salt and blueberries in the pancakes actually we made a mistake on this i thought it was just oats but it turned out to be oat flour so we had to like blend everything after it was all mixed these are really interesting because i don't think they have any sort of leavener in them so they're kind of flat in a way like they don't have any rise they're just egg whites <laughs> yeah so i think the texture will be interesting it tastes like oatmeal. Isn't that kind of what it is? Yeah, because you literally made oatmeal in the blender. It's not very light and fluffy at mm -hmm. all, which is to be expected. It's just like some solid oatmeal. Mm -hmm. Overall taste, I'd give this a four. I think I would eat it over at Linda Sun's because I'm a little more fond of the oatmeal rather than the protein powder texture. I think these are a step above Linda Sun's, but still I wouldn't make it. So maybe I should lower Linda Sun's to three. Oh no. And this to four. How close it is to original pancakes, it's like a one. Yeah, I, I yeah. Think it's a one. <laughs> There's not little similarity. similarity. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Natasha. <laughs> We're not starting up hot here. <laughs> so next we have Chloe Ting's, which is very simple. It's just banana, egg, flour and olive oil which is interesting um, oh, so yeah. we just made like two of these very cute and simple 
much Hers better. Look good. Mm -hmm. The inside looks pretty. It's just very strong banana flavor, which is expected. Yeah, it's very banana flavor. I like these. They're much closer to the texture of actual pancakes. So as for the overall taste, I'd say this is seven. Yeah, I'd say this is like six maybe. It's fine. Yeah, it's a very standard like banana flavored pancake. Mm -hmm, yeah. As for how close it is to the actual pancake, this is still like a seven. But like the, the flavor is not close at all. Yeah, I'd say like maybe four. Oh. Well, this is uh, one of the better ones so far. Okay, so next we have Blogilati's pancakes. Again, these have protein powder, so the color is a little bit interesting. So this one has banana, protein powder, egg whites, baking powder, and water. When I added the water to the baking powder, it started like fizzing. So yeah, I was like, that's just <gasps> what happens. Hmm. The protein powder makes things bitter. Oh yeah, it does a little bit. Right. Okay, also to disclaim is that this is actually our first time for both of us to eat protein powder in anything. Tell us what's a good brand of protein powder mm -hmm. to buy. Cause yeah, I think <laughs> we're clueless, yeah. This one in terms of overall taste is five. It's like, I'm just on the edge. It's the protein powder for me. <laughs> Bruh. And in terms of how close it is to actual pancakes, it's three. Just really? Because. I think it's a little better. Look at the texture. The graininess is a problem, but like yeah, at least yeah, it has yeah. some lift. Yeah, because of the baking powder. So what would you rate like closeness? Maybe like four or five. Four probably. Four, okay. The only thing a little bit close is a little bit of the texture, but the taste yeah. and others are completely off. We are nearing the end of this taste test. There is just one more. We it's... have one more. Yeah, we do. Wait, what? That's it? Yeah. Okay, well, I guess that was all. So I have brought back the original so we can refresh our palettes. No tea, no shade. But from the way that these influencers exclaim like, wow, so good when they eat their recipes, you would think it's better. Just with these pancakes, I only started using this recipe recently, but like this recipe, it really tastes like pancakes. Before when I've been eating pancakes, it didn't have, you know, the pancake taste. It's turned into a mukbang at this point. <laughs> I'm a little bit let down, but we still have to not waste food, make the rest of the <laughs> hip batter, and eat all of these influencer pancakes. If you'd like to try any of these pancake recipes, I will link all of the recipes and videos down below. Again, no tea to any of the influencers <laughs> mentioned. We it feels like you are wanting to say something. <laughs> no, I don't like want to say anything. This. Just the protein powder is very important. Okay, yeah. If we change the protein powder and we make this again and it still tastes like this, then it's not our problem. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. If you've come this far, please subscribe if you like the content we see here and let us know if you'd like to see more of us together in videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.